Welcome to Life Journey. Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ, oh God, touched every person that watched this video right now. Let them know the importance of confessing now and bowing now. In the name of Jesus Christ, so God, we, we confess now, we bow now to be saved. Later, will oh God, we be damned, we be lost forever, for eternity. Bless this person right now. Oh God, before they finish watching this video, let them yield to the name of Jesus to be saved. Bless right now, in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Isaiah, 45th chapter, verse 23. And I read, I have sworn by myself, the word is gone out of my mouth in righteousness and shall not return that unto every knee shall bow. Every tongue shall swear. And glory to God. Also in Philippian. Philippian, he glory to God, Philippian. Chapter two. Philippians chapter 2, verse 10, 11, that at the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow of things in heaven and things in earth and things under the earth, and that every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. My message today to you is confess, bow now to be saved. Confess and bow now to be saved. Later, you'll be lost. Confess and bow now to be saved. Confess and bow later, you'll be lost. You ever heard people say that I would never, I would never confess, I'll never bow? They're ignorant because the Bible say that at the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow. Every knee mean what? Every knee mean if you are black, if you are white, if you are Hispanic, if you are Asian, if you are Japanese, if you are Chinese, every knee, if you are, if you are atheist, if you are agnostic, if you are Satanist, every knee going to bow. My friend, I'm doing it now. I'm confessing now. I'm bowing now at the name of Jesus. It's amazing that how people, they are bowing and they are confessing to the wrong deity, to the wrong person, to the wrong spirit. They are bowing to their job. They're bowing to sports. They're bowing to sex. They're bowing to Satan. According to God, they're bowing, my friend. But guess what? If they don't bow now, if they don't confess now, they're going to do it later. We live in a world, my friend, where people are ignorant. Yes, the Bible says every, and this is a, I'm doing fulfillment of the scripture. We see that in, in, in Isaiah 45, 23, he said, I saw now by myself that every knee going to bow. Every tongue going to confess. So I'm telling you right now, if you're watching the video right now, my friend, you better bow now. What bow mean? Bow mean, hey, go to God to, to worship. To worship. You're going to worship God, but guess what? Your worship going to be too late. I'm making a video to somebody. If you're watching the video, my friend, hallelujah, and you're upset with me, don't be upset, up, upset with me. Ups, get upset with the word of God. The Bible says every knee going to bow. People bow, glory to God, to a statue that eyes can't, you, a statue can't see you. A statue can't feel you. A statue can't walk, hallelujah. But at the name of Jesus, every knee gonna bow. So people, glory to God, when they get up in the morning, they don't fall on their knees. When they get in the morning, they go to the bathroom. When they get in the morning, go to God, hallelujah, they go in the kitchen. When they get in the morning, they put their clothes on and they walk out the door without bowing to Jesus. Hallelujah. My friend, if you don't bow now, you're going to bow later. Well, I say, if you don't bow and confess now, you're going to do it later. So if I was you, 
I bow now. I confess now to be saved because you're going to do it later. It'll be too late. It'll be too late. Hey, glory to God. I'll tell somebody right now, my friend, how you bow now. You bow now by falling on your knees and Lord, I worship you as my God and as my Savior. I confess you as my King of Kings and Lord of Lord. Lord, save me right now. My friend, let's go. Let's bow now and confess it now because you're going to do it later. And there are a lot of people that's watching the video, my friend. Hey, glory to God. You think, my friend, you're not going to bow. Hey, glory to God. The Bible says, I send forth my word and heal them. And my word shall not return back void. So I don't care if you're the president of your country, you're going to bow. Hey, glory to God. Look at Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. They, def they refused to bow at the golden statue. They refused to bow at the music. And they say, King, we're not careful to answer you in this matter. But we know the God that we serve, you're going to deliver us out of your hand and going to deliver us from the fire furnace. And guess what? They didn't bow. They, was they were put into the fire furnace, my friend. Hey, glory to God. But the Bible said God took the, the took the power out of the flame. God took the, the power, hey, glory to God, out of the fire. And the Bible say, glory to God, when the king opened, opened the, the furnace, my friend, he saw a fourth one, and the fourth one looked like the Son of God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Somebody needs to hear this, my friend. If you're not bowing now, you're going to do it later. I'd rather bow now. How you bow now? You bow now. Say, Lord, save me, Lord. Come into my life, Lord. Hallelujah. I'm a wretch. Hallelujah. I want to be saved. Bow now. Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. What does it cost to bow now? Nothing. Hey, glory to God. But to give your life to Jesus Christ. If you don't bow now, hey, glory to God, you're going to bow later. Prove it, preacher. Hallelujah. I'm going to prove that you're going to bow later. Hallelujah. And guess what? It's going to be too late. Because the Bible says, I'm going to read it to you because I don't want you to think I'm making it up, my friend. The Bible, hallelujah, is the book, hallelujah, of reformation. The Bible is a book to condemn you. The Bible is a book to save you. Hey, glory to God. Listen, my friend. The Bible say in Revelation, the 20th chapter, hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. And it's amazing, my friend. The, the Bible hey, is the book of reformation, my friend. Hey, glory to God. And the Bible tell us, my friend, that hallelujah, Revelation the 20th chapter, oh, glory to God, hallelujah, 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 glory to God. The God word is to be true, my friend. In Revelation, the 20th chapter, Hey, glory to God. Let's start at, hallelujah, verse 11. Say, say 11, glory to God. Hallelujah. And it's this is what the Bible say. The Bible say, my friend, hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. And I saw a great white throne and him that sat on it. Hallelujah. Who is that? Jesus. Hallelujah. And from whose face, hallelujah, hallelujah, and the, the him, that sat on it, from whose face the earth and the heaven fled, hallelujah, and there were found no place for them. And I saw the dead, small and great, hallelujah, stand before God, and the books were open, and the book were open, hallelujah, which is the book of life, hallelujah, glory to God, hallelujah. And the dead were judged out of those things which are written in the book according to their works. And what, what do you say? I saw, hallelujah, I saw, what do you say? I saw, and the sea gave up the dead which were in it, and death and hell would deliver up the dead which were in it, and they would judge every man according to their works. And the death and hell were cast in a lake of fire. This is a second death. And whosoever was not found written in a book of life was cast into the lake of fire. I'm telling you right now, my friend. Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. <laughs>